Hey, what's up, guys? This is Travel Peace. And considering this goes well, I am back. Sorry about the all the audio quality. I am in the works of getting things going again. Uh, well, first of all, I would like to explain my lack of uploads and blah 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 blah. Well, but well, well, pretty much what it was was there's I get thing. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> that is an x-ray thing. I wonder if that works in the overworld. I'll have to try that out sometime, guys. Oh, there we go, goody. We got a plan. But yeah, anyway, uh... This is... Crispy Craft! Season... Two. Yeah, I'm kind of a bit, I'm kind of a bit late with getting the in, this introduction going for this. Da 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 da. da. I have a face all together. Like, case in point, there's zero or like the spawn hub. It's pretty much. I believe this is about as done as it's gonna be. I don't know what Zenobas plan or Adino plan is with it. That's Zenobia, by the way, you guys. Uh, but, and yeah, anyway, what we're gonna do today is we are going to take a look around my base here. Well, starting from the spawn. Or, starting from the nether hub. Anyway, go through here, I got a nice little tunnel going, and... Yeah, that's, that's about it. It's a tunnel. This is a tunnel. There we go. Okay. And here's my main tunnel. That's just a branch off that I made. I still have to do the roof and that, but that's a branch off I made because I followed myself and I wanted a path right straight directly to the spawn portal. And touch and yeah. But yeah, like this I get got flashing lights. I have a contrasting Packed ice and lava. Is already turned on. And Sibling, yeah. Save the world. Yeah, but I know a lot of people use packed ice for floors, like this. But I actually like it as a, I actually like it as an element in the ceiling. I think it, I, I think that it ends up looking really good, especially with, especially with the lighter colors that I that I use in the Nether. So, yeah. And I got stairs and crafting tables lining the way too. And I got my chest here with the backdrop of magma blocks. And then this way I, I have a blaze grinder. Uh, at the beginning of the season, we tried out silk spawners, and so I and I grabbed myself some quite a few uh, blaze spawners. But the issue with them is was that. Uh, the permissions weren't quite working. So, yeah. The reason why I was able to have er, to, to, to use it was because, due to the fact that I am one of the people that actually try to recruit people into the server, I have I have operator status, and so ops have all the permissions. That's how I was able to do it. And that right there, that big monstrosity, that's a super zombie ender. <laughs> this right here is something that I grabbed over from my time on 1b1t.xyz. For those of you that based with me on there, you will remember this. Because I pretty much did the exact same design here. A whole bunch of mob a whole bunch of mobs, zombie spawners on the top here. Here, 
water going down straight to the bottom three by three platform and you just kill them all well you you stand up on that that ledge for a while wait for the moat to all collect up and then you come down and just rake in the XP and hear all the zombie deaths but yes anyway this right here this is my base as it is right now and these are all my parrots I only have a couple yeah I things didn't really <laughs> 1.12 that's all I can say it's just 1.12 which as you can see my base is pretty much 1.12 based yes I'm kind of going off of Iskel's Iskel 85's Plastic Fantastic uh, but I'm more so doing my kind of a take on it I'm doing Legoland yes <laughs> I guess Gally just has straight one color for the for, for, for the ground area and straight yellow for the for the sand or for the beach area but I have yellow conca powder orange and red sand lining the beach and I actually think it looks really good and I'm gonna do like a little bloodbath type thing here too so yeah <laughs> I suppose that's what's with all the redstone. Oh, hello, Mr. Zombie. How you doing? Bye-bye. I gotta make more trees. This place looks empty without a bunch of trees. Yeah. Just, anyway, uh, this is a Mesa biome. Obvious. Obviously. <laughs> oh. Also, I would like to thank uh, Zuma or Zuma Void for having having those awesome resource pack additives on his website. I am enjoying having the old the old uh, damage sound. Oh, and also too another thing that I am enjoying is from there is one thing I don't like about 1.12. It's hard in clay. Yeah. I know that's not really that much of a big deal, but it it's 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 a, it's a personal thing. Like for the longest time it has been hard as hard in clay, so I will continue to call it hard in clay. And I will continue to recognize it as hard in clay. But yeah. Terracotta that could be those fancy glazed blocks. That's that's what I'll that's all refer to as terracotta. But anyway, this is my base here, kind of going off of what Ishkelly if I was doing, but if I dash if I'm doing Lego land, etc. Blah, 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 blah. I kind of go off topic, yeah. But yes, I'm doing a bit of a lining here, and there. I don't know what I'm going to do with this area yet. That area there, or I'll show you in a bit. I'll show you that area in a bit. And I have a little stream here. I know that es Iskel did that, did that uh, cobble wall, and did a cobble wall trick with the falling, with the falling objects, or with the gravity effect block trick thing. Yeah, but I'm doing it like this because I think that that looks really good. With the blue concrete below, and then uh, that's light blue or yeah, light blue, light blue glass over. And I have it flowing down into the actual river. And if you wonder about that, I did. I have this pretty much exploding with lava before. Yeah, I was bored, and I got rid of it because it wasn't really going along with the style that I wanted. And it was impeding what I was wanting to, or what 
any progress I was wanting to make up with, with over here. And yeah, oh, and I have a cat too. His name is Chester. The memory of the cat that I had before. It is the same cat I got too. But anyway, we're moving on. We have a skeleton horse there. And this right here. This was actually. Well, this area here. This bottom portion. Actually, one of the first things I built. I was going to do something along the lines of another spire. But. At this point, I've done about three or four of them on different servers. And I, I just didn't really have much drive to do them. Do it. And so I was actually, I didn't really make much progress on the server for a while, and until I started watching Iskal85 things, and I noticed this blast fantastic, and I was like, oh, that's actually really nice. I wonder how it'd look if I did a take on it. And then I came on here, and I, for about a couple days, I just went all nuts and whatnot, and ended up with this. Oh yeah. I'm taking a break right now. That that area is gonna get finished up yet, yeah, but I'm taking a break right now because I have had enough of that. For the time being. So in the meantime, I am actually playing around with things like this here. I was up up above here I was going to make a uh, Iron Phoenix, but then I noticed that uh, Dragon's Dead Flames was making one at spawn for the public iron farm, which I was like, oh, okay. I have all the supplies in here for it. I have all the supplies in here for it, so yeah. And I just wanted to show off that the elevator. <laughs> I actually like this elevator. I actually like how this ba I actually like how my base is looking. So yes. And now if we come down here and then jump off and fly over, that was my starting cactus farm. And then I moved to this one here. I built this one here. I put all that terracotta on the bottom there for design aspects. And got those opened up right now. I don't. I didn't. I didn't close those in. I just covered the glass for the time being. Anyway, don't know if I'll keep it or not. But it actually does look pretty, pretty neat. And then stacked on top of the uh, cacti farm, I have a reed farm. Oh, and actually the cacti farm. I'll show you in a bit here. I'll show you exactly in a bit here. And somewhere around here I have a little secret place to put a, rest, a piece of redstone dust, which is another reason why I have the redstone dust all over, that uh, will, will open up a little staircase that's somewhere on this beach to my storage area, to my living area. And we're back. So this right here is my little secret area. I think I did pretty good here. What do you think? I like it. <laughs> it's nice. Everything everything seems to fit well together actually. Got this here, all that. Got some little chests areas for quick storage. Oh, I just did that. I got yeah. The top there is just aesthetics really. And here, it's aesthetics and functionality. Got, the, got a couple furnaces, anvils all around. And got cauldrons, brewing station, brewing stands ready to go with aqua potions. Got crafting table. Got an enchanting area. Full enchanting room. Yeah, I just had to point that out. I actually think I did pretty good with this area, with these areas here. And then if we go down here, it's into my main storage area. It's bounce, say 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 bounce. Ooh. 
this is my storage, just my main storage areas. I haven't done the walls like this going up yet, but I will get to that. It will generally all be like this when I'm done. Which I actually think is really nice. Oh, where did that lava go? That's a mystery. Anyway, yes, I have all the storage to work with, and now, oh, yes, you guys know I love store. I love my storage. Well, you should, anyway. You might not, but, yeah, I do. Also, oh. Bouncy, 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 bouncy. Yes, with the slime pad, or with the slime landing pad. Of course, I had to make a trampoline. <laughs> So otherwise, it also broke up the the grays. So otherwise, I, I did have more stone bricks going around here, which it did look decent, but it was just too much. And then I got the minecarts going up. Oh yes, I just wanted. I actually want to check on the ow. Or whatever. Uh, for about all that, I did have a mob farm over here, but it moved to the so I'll be showing you guys that later. I got the things from my chicken farm. I got them all filtered. And then there's th that's coming from my reed farm, and that's coming from my cactus farm. Look at all that. I can do so much more ground with that, with all this cacti screen. That is cactus ground. Oh. How long has it been named that? Come out this way. Now uh, we have another full enchanting area. Oh, I didn't turn this up. This is my blaze grinder. I was talking about there. Yes. Get all this here, all the science directions. Got some dump storage and storage here, that's out, that's out, that's out. No. No. And then here, this will go to the area that we're going to next. Now uh, this is where the mob drop farm was, but moved away. I did have an elevator going up there and that, but uh, all the hoppers and that, which is why I didn't really focus on the ceiling was because it's a maintenance tunnel of action close. Here. Oh, we're getting kind of low on blaze. Blaze rods. Yeah, I don't like that. I gotta do some more grind or what? Or, no. Oh, yeah, no, no, no. We're, we're still good. We're still good. If this, this block is was dark, then we'd be, yeah. Uh, how much do we have? I know we were about, yeah, we're about there, okay. Okay, yeah. And anyway, right here we have all this going. This is coming from the cacti farm. Get into an auto smelter. So it's actually a dye farm. A green dye farm. To fuel all my concrete obsessions. <laughs> Alrighty, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna fly over. Oh, wait. And right. There. Isn't that better? Oh, yes. Yes, 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 yes. And we'll do that and that. Oh, that's where the holes would be if I had eyes. I don't have eyes though. <laughs> anyway, yes, we're gonna head over towards that way. And you'll see the huge monstrosity that is my block logo. That thing's actually pretty big. I'm up and up and up and up and up and right to that mumbo jumbo mob farm. 
which I think I did a pretty good job on. It's got a nice looking design to it, and all this looks pretty and it's efficient because it's mumbo and all that jazz and up and up the highest in the air. And yes. Anyway, we're going to my little landing platform area. Right there. I like how I did that actually. I, I like how I set that up. <coughs> and then yes, we got the mob farm here. And yes, as I said, it looks good. I think I did a really good job on it. Come down this way. We can come down and watch them getting slaughtered firsthand. And I can dump these items in there. Splat. Oh, yes. <laughs> Piano tiles mark the filter. Next with this. Usually I would have taken one of each drop and put it into the filter before. But I just... I did up the filter, but didn't add the filter requirement, or but, but I didn't add the filter item, and I just I just let it do itself, and it just turned out pretty nicely. So as I'm usually I'm a OCD like that, and I have like sugar, redstone, glowstone, and gunpowder together because they're shaped the same. Uh, bones, arrows, sticks together, and then. Rotten flesh and a spider eyes together and then bottle and string. Yeah. But this actually turned out pretty nicely. And yes, I got all these all messed around because I am not OCD like that. This season. <laughs> yes. But anyway, that's that right there would pretty much wrap, wrap this up and as I said hopefully this turns out good because I would really like to start getting videos out again and actually who knows this might have even ended up if this, end, this did end up going good the, the video itself might end up being actually better quality than my recordings have been in the past and so <laughs> the next so if that's the case then the only thing I have to do is just will just be will be to just get my stumble ice microphone hooked up which I actually have a dragon pad pop filter for now I just ordered it the other week and it came in from Amazon and I have it oh I have it set up here and yeah anywho this where'd you go Where'd you go? Excuse me, guys. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Oh, there you are. Ha, I thought I lost you. Anyway, this has been Charful Peace with Chris... Or, sorry. <clears throat> Chris the Craft Season 2! Yeah. I'll catch you guys in the next video. And... Peace!